Santa Barbara community is mourning the loss of those involved in the Conception Boat Fire early this morning with a memorial set up in the Santa Barbara Harbor. KSBY News reporter Michael Torres is live on the scene there for us tonight. All right, Michael, what can you tell us? Well, Richard, it's clear that the community in Santa Barbara is hurting after the Conception Boat Fire tragedy earlier today. Now, just a couple of moments ago, a boat called Vision has docked here at the Santa Barbara Harbor. Now, this boat is believed to be owned by the same company and it was supposed to make a return later this week, but made an earlier docking earlier than expected. Now, the reason for that is still unclear at this time, but earlier today, 34 candles were placed and lit at the memorial and a woman I spoke with who called the conception a landmark in the area says she feels helpless after today's news. Sad, I, I only live four blocks from here and I walk down here literally every night of the week and I've walked through the harbor a million times and the Conception's just, it's like a local icon. It's been here forever, it's extremely well known. The Conception was a mainstay at the Santa Barbara Harbor and longtime Santa Barbara resident Orlando Aldana was at the memorial to show his support and says he was on that boat 15 years ago. It was a great trip and we roughed through 14 foot swells and the captain did a great job and I never felt scared, even though there were really high swells and I had never experienced that. But yeah, I, I think it's a great boat and it was just tragedy. Aldana brought candles, exactly 34 of them, in honor of the 34 on board who have either been found dead or have yet to be recovered. And so I just wanted to light candles for them just so that they know that they're being remembered. While people are bringing flowers and candles like Aldana to the memorial to remember those who are lost, the community is still in pain. It's just, it's a, it's a community feeling of loss and helplessness because like you saw the people here earlier, there's nothing you can really do. I'm sure at the end of the day, I'm going to know somebody that was on that boat. This, this is a small community and it's, it's tragic, it's sad and I know a lot of people will be affected by this. Aldana says that he will be here at the memorial tomorrow to continue to light those candles for those who are lost. And for anyone who has questions, the county does have a line for people to call, and that number is 833-688-5551. Live in Santa Barbara, I'm Michael Torres, KSBY News. All right, thank you, Michael. In case you missed it, you can also find that number on our website. That is ksby.com.